Hi everyone, it's been a while since I went to Gucci, so I decided to drop by. I tried on a few bags, I really would welcome your opinion. So this is the Diana bag with the bamboo handle, this is the latest one. It's so super cute guys because of the mini size and I love the bamboo handles. As you know, I have a bamboo handle Gucci bag that looks just as good as new to be honest. I'm not too sure about those stuff around the handle though. I know it's supposed to keep them from cracking or expanding. But I don't know. It looks a bit strange to me. And then of course, I tried on the horse bit hobo. And this is the Jackie 1961. This is in cream color. Kind of an off-white. Which is also very pretty. Um, Here I'm just admiring the little Diana again. And it's just a simple tote bag. But it's so pretty, so precious. This is the Jackie and I love it in this cream color. Um, you know, it actually looks much better in person when you try it on especially. So I was kind of surprised that I liked it. This is the horse bit hobo with the crossbody strap. This is the small um in the white or cream leather, full leather version. So it is kind of a flat back and you can see the horse bit, signature horse bit. Um, at the front of the bag, it has another strap as well and then just taking a look at what they had on display um, I quite like it, like it but I'm not 100% sure um, here I'm looking at the canvas version of the Jackie so it's the signature GG canvas with a brown trim and it is really pretty, a very classic Gucci bag but um, yeah, so I'm trying to decide. This is the super mini one, which is just too small. At least this one can be used in the daytime as well, I think. Um, it is pretty flat though, so it fits quite nicely under your um, arm. And this is the horse bit hobo in canvas with the white trim. Um, I think it's pretty too, but yeah, I don't know. I'm still not sure. I just couldn't stand this green color, guys. Not sure if you guys like green, but I didn't like that green. This is the larger version of the horse bit hobo. I think it's a little bit too large. This is really at work kind of bag and it is, I don't know, it seemed pretty bulky to me. I'm not sure what do you guys think. Um, you know, of course I was wearing a black dress as well. So yeah, this I have on the horse bit hobo on crossbody with the shorter strap. I think it looks really cute, but I don't know. I mean like too many pretty things guys. So, um, haven't even been to Gucci in a long time, but I was pleasantly surprised. Oh, I didn't like this at all. This is really a work tote almost, so definitely not this one. So, yep, that's all, guys. Hi, everyone. Welcome to today's video. So, um, as you can see, I went to Gucci uh, with my friend last night when I was just, you know, I just had a quick dinner with my girlfriend. Um, it was in the Gardens Mall, uh, which is kind of a quite a good mall. It's not too far from my house, so I don't have to go all the way to the CV Center, uh, Kuala Lumpur. Um, for basically, that's where Pavilion KLCC is, where a lot of luxury stores are. So Gardens is pretty good. So guys, like I know, right? I've been going to a lot of places looking for bags because I'm just itching for a new bag. So uh, as some of you may know, I'm hoping to get a Birkin soon, but then that will take a while. Um, at least a few more months, right? So, um, meanwhile, I'm really itching for a new bag and I don't know what bag to get. Um, I don't want to spend too much, so I thought I went to LV. As you can see earlier, I quite like the on-the-go, but I was really sad that the white is gone because I'm really wanting a white bag. So yesterday, I stepped into um, Gucci and as you can see, uh, out of the bags that I tried, the Jackie, which is a hobo style, which I tried in a white full leather and the canvas, the Gigi um, Supreme canvas with the brown trim. And then I tried on the Diana with the cute, super cute bamboo handles. And also I tried on the um, horse bit hobo, which is, I guess, a more classic shape. You know, it's also a flat bag. So I thought I would kind of want to move away from that because I have some flaps, right, from Chanel, uh, Valentino, etc. So... After thinking about it and talking to some of my friends and, you know, uh, my Instagram friends as well who love luxury and my, you know, real life friends, um, I think I might really want to get the Diana, guys, because it is so super cute. It has feet 
and my experience with Gucci bamboo handle has been excellent. So this bag is at least 20 year, uh, 20 year old bag. Some of you might have seen it on my Instagram. I just dug it out and started using it again. It's still in super, super great condition and the bamboo is just superb. So um, this bag used to have a shoulder strap but I can't find it anymore because basically my mom bought this for me when I was like still studying but you know it's really 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 good quality and bamboo is just so um, Gucci and they have a copyright on bamboo handles so you don't see bamboo handles in any other uh, brands, luxury brands and the essay yesterday he told me that uh, the bamboo is actually sourced from Japan and um, the way they treat it, I guess it's very um, different. So it lasts for so long. And I can personally testify that the bamboo handle really lasts forever. And it's very comfortable to hold, even in the crook of your arm. It's very smooth, etc. So what do you guys think? I really want your input. I think I might really go for the Diana bag. But the mini is super, super cute and even has feet. But I just don't know. I might want to upsize just one size. So going for the small. So I'll put some pictures. Uh, I forgot to try that on yesterday because I was just so taken in by the mini because at least then I can use it for work. The small size would be comparable to the ABC Dior that I have. And yeah guys, um, to be honest, I also like the Jackie bag. Um, it's the Jackie Hobo bag 1961. So the Diana bag is named after Princess Diana. You know, she also used a similar bag back in the day in the 80s. So I'll put a picture of that. Um, so it's like I was trying to decide between Jackie and Diana and so the horse bit hobo is like almost out It's not on my list. It is very cute But just because it is quite a classic shape that you know, I already have So I really really am leaning more towards Gucci now rather than LV to be honest with you guys And um, this is just another example of a Gucci you know this is not bamboo obviously this is made of metal It's hardware, so it has rusted a little bit or cut um I guess it has oxidized because I've had it had this also when I was studying. My mom bought it for me. But it is overall great condition. It is in the Tom Ford era when Gucci was uh, under Tom Ford. So what do you guys think? I think I might really go for the Dyna bag just because it's so cute. Um, they have the, elas the elasticated belt straps across the bamboo handles now which this one didn't have the old ones don't have that it's actually to stop the uh, bamboo from expanding etc but i don't really have such a problem with this one so i was a little bit surprised but overall that bag is very well made um it has feet which i just love especially when you're putting your bag on the surface of anything table obviously i do not put my bags on the floor no matter what because i'm you know chinese and uh, we believe in bad luck if you're placing your money on the floor so to speak so um apart from that the price point is also quite attractive the price point of the gucci diana mini is about eleven thousand ringgit so i need to check the essay on like what's the price for the next size up so i might not go for the pink if i have to go for the next size up just because i have the pink lady dior which uh you know technically sometimes i can still use that for work if i wanted to because it is a kind of small to medium size bag so if i do get the medium or oh, sorry small diana tote i might go for the blue which is looks a bit like sea green bluish you know um or the white or off-white if they have it or even the cognac color the brown their brown is really really rich and it looks really nice right so i don't know guys i really look forward to your opinions but for now i think lv is really like really not really um on my radar again even though i do love my essay super i really really love him he's just super good so if you have anything you want to buy from lv and if you're located in kl do let me know i'll give you his contact details uh, but as for myself i think i'm really itching to get a bag but i'm gonna go see my hermes essay really soon so i'll see what um she has for me um at the same time yeah i just want to share a weird story so when you try on bags right don't be like me and be careless and leave your bag on the counter so i brought my cocoa handle the pale gold one to gucci yesterday i put it on the counter as i was trying out the gucci bags and some like random customers they just walked past and, um and they were like tr they tried they touched my bag and i was like just shocked and I reacted within seconds. I was like, oh, sorry, please don't touch my bag. That's my bag. And they were like, oh, we thought it was Gucci. And I was like, this is obviously Chanel. So it's just, it was just really, really weird. And I felt like very, I know it's a bit dramatic, but I felt a bit vi violated on behalf of my bag. Like even my friends don't really touch my bag that way. So 
yeah, just a side story, guys. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed the Gucci shopping vlog. I have very good service. I like how uh, Gucci is like decorated, you know, the interior decoration, you know, it's just been a while. I've, it's been a few years since I've stepped into Gucci. So the essay told me they have already renovated since uh, quite a... Uh, maybe a couple of years back but it's just that i didn't realize i got great customer service as well so um yeah i'm really seriously considering the diner bag at first i wanted the jackie bag but i think it is slightly a bit too flat and um yeah i don't know i just find that the bamboo handle is just uniquely gucci and it's something that they do very very well and it's actually a bag worth buying from gucci so i used to own the marmon bag the pink uh, camera bag and I sold that because after a while, uh, to me, it looks a bit dated, but it's really up to your preference, right? So, um, but for me, bamboo handle from Gucci, you can never go wrong. So I think that is a bag that is bag that is worth buying from Gucci. And uh, I believe that is the latest um, design that they have to offer. So if I get the mini, it's going to be super suitable. Like when I want to go out or use it for Chinese New Year, it's pink, right? But if I do get the next size up, it will be a bit more versatile because I can use that for work because I carry a separate laptop bag anyway. So do let me know your thoughts, guys. And let me know if which bags you're looking for at Gucci. And I'll go try them on the next time when I go and purchase that Dyna bag. Because the next time I step into Gucci, I'm going to like buy something, I believe, probably that bag. I just can't decide mini or... Uh, small so well if you watch this far guys i hope that uh you know if you're new to my channel as well please do subscribe to my channel i'd love for you to do that and also please give this video a thumbs up and leave me a comment anytime i always respond and uh, follow me on instagram if you want to as well so i hope you have a wonderful day and see you really soon bye mm -hmm.